shit. Something's going down. Hi, Mom. Uh, so I got my ticket home from Europe. I get back on June 6th, but it's a really late flight because... Yeah, that's the one I already... Did I already check these? Maybe. Alright. So something's going on with my sister. Okay, yeah, my mom works at Goodfellow High School. That's a dope jacket. Over the Alps, a novel traveling game. That is a mom game if I've ever seen one. Front hall. Nothing behind the door. Dear Jan, so good to hear from you again. I miss you, Rumi. Carol. More directories. Come on, close it. You got this. Alright. Shall I go upstairs or do the east wing first? Hmm. Oh jeez, that thunder and lightning scared the shit out of me. I think I'm gonna do the east wing first. Nobody's saying anything in chat, so I'm gonna do that. Oh no, it's locked. Fuck. Guess I'm going upstairs. Oh god. No, go the other way, you'll die. I can't go any other way. But now I'm nervous and I'm peeking around every corner. Another deck of cards. Controlled burn schedule for Boone County. Fun. That's what happens when I eat Taco Bell. It's a controlled burn. Cooking class ballroom dancing. Ooh. Couples bowling. Wow, mom was a busy lady. There's no control burn with Taco Bell, says Angel Bait. No, you're true. Okay. Oh, can I comb this fern? No. Notice of temporary personal personnel transfer. Okay. Why don't we ever do couples bowling? You want you want to go bowling? We can go bowling if you want to go bowling. I just don't want to have to console you when you cry because you fall down or aren't good at bowling. Oh. Okay, I found a tape. Where was that tape layer? It was in the living room, right? Just whispered, hey you. Pardon? Someone just whispered, hey you. Jesus Christ, that scared the shit out of me. It's weird hanging out with girls. Daniel was around ever since I was little, and other girls? I don't know. But being around Lonnie is like instantly just right. 
I gave her the grand Psycho House tour. And took my revenge on Super Nintendo. Nice. And it was like, I don't know. I finally found someone I feel normal around. Cute. I drove her home and she gave me this tape and said, You have got to listen to this. I haven't stopped playing it since. Cute. Alright, fuck off, creepy house. Read sternly worded letter. To whom it may concern, I, Samantha Greenbrier, am 17 years old and am therefore an independent, fully functional human being. The fact that you still forbid me from going into the city on my own is frankly absurd. Compare with Katie, who is only three years older than me, and yet you allowed her to go all the way across an ocean to another continent on her own. I just want to spend an evening in a normal, totally safe city on my own like a human being since you may also remember that i have my own car now you can't really stop me what the fuck was that what the fuck sounded like someone like picking at a lock or something Stop leaving every damn light on in the house. You're as bad as your sister. Oh, God. Turn that off immediately. I assume this is the sister's room? Quick, turn on every light in the room. Got your number. King's Labyrinth. Dope binder. Oh. There's a holy bibble hidden there. A singular holy bibble. Mittens. 1888? That's creepy. Sonic Boom 1994. I wrote this first period and left it in your locker on the way to second. That's what all the cool kids are doing. I've decided. Write me back. Also, here's an idea for something to draw. Two cats on a motorcycle. What the cool kids are actually doing is sending each other pages on their beepers. But we're cooler than them because guess what? They can't put this on a beeper. There's that fucking noise again. Well, the VCR's gone from here too. Oh, Adventure the Cat? Chun Li moves. Dope. I can't see those fucking hidden images games. Super Spitfire. Journey of Crystal. What was that? Another tape player, that's good to know. We're so cool, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're so cool, cool. We're so cool, yeah, yeah. Fuck you too, cool smug. <laughs>
Cool. Not creepy at all. That was great. I loved every second of it. I loved it. Sam, I think the creative writing track would be perfect for you. Oh, neat. So my sister was following the dad's footsteps, I suppose. Hence the, like, short story chapter I found in her closet, I guess. What's that? Look who dad is... Look whose dad is weird. Well. I hear ambient music starting. The Misfits. Oliver Twist, Tom Sawyer, Call of the Wild. War of the Worlds. That's the skinniest version of War of the Worlds I've ever seen in my life. Alright, what's over by the bed? Groove Magazine. Eddie Vedder and Weezer. Those were some good times for music. Subject shop one, metalwork engraving, grade C minus. My god, open the locker, find a body? What locker? No privacy in this house, clearly. Well, no one's fucking here. I'm trying to figure out what happened to my fam jam. This is the one me and dad are building. Want to go for a ride when it's done. Nice. So she liked writing and rode motorcycles. This person seems dope. Dope. Oh, they have an X-Files poster. Wish there was a jump button. Oh god. Bedroom has two doors. Bathroom. Good. Nail polish. Anal cream. Lonnie rules. Oh god. Maybe Lonnie did something. Have a good one, CPU. Love your page, by the way. Real original. Thanks. I think. I appreciate that. I don't know which page you're talking about exactly, but I super appreciate the love. Oh my god, there's blood on the tub. Oh no, it's fake blood. Oh. Throw you for a loop. Red right hand. Semi-permanent hair color. Lonnie brought her hair dye over today. She said, I need to fix these roots. Think you could help? Dying hair is weirdly intimate. I don't know if I've touched someone else's scalp before. That's pretty intimate, right? It felt intimate. We looked in the mirror together after, and I expected her to say something about how it looked crappy, or good, or whatever. But that's when she said, You're so beautiful. Aww. And she was looking at me. Right in that moment, I wanted to say something. But I waited. And the moment was gone. Do you want to see Pulp Fiction after school? Yes. Mom is supposed to cook dinner tonight for a change, but I can just ditch out on it probably. What time? According to Todd, it's pretty hardcore. I guess Uma Thurman gets stabbed in the heart with a heroin needle. So that's kind of hilarious. 
So they went to go see Pulp Fiction. Real romantic couples movie. Okay, this bedroom looks like it's been torn apart. And I'm not creeped out at all. What the fuck was that? I hate this. I hate it. I hate it so much. Hi, Mom and Dad and Sam. I'm in the channel. This is my second passage through the channel. I'm on my way back from London. This time I'm going to Brussels. Nice. A Bibla. I think the creepiest part about all the creaks and stuff is that my camera isn't sensitive enough for me to like whip around really quickly. Oh, I can change it. I'm changing it quite a bit. That's that's better. Oh, okay. That's a nice room in the middle of the house. Bunch of dad jeans. Does it just say O oh, barf? Ooh, Nero lubricated. One premium lubricated latex condom. Wait, so if the sister's 17, that makes me like 20, right? All the President's Men, Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid. There are no VCRs in this house. I'm pretty sure there's a reason why the, all the VCRs have been removed. And I'll tell you what, I'm not looking forward to finding out why. Mitten the cat. Ew. Dirty ganch. Cute. Dear Jan, oh honey, let me tell you, I understand how you feel. Bob and I have had our own down periods. Oh, my mom was venting to someone about her. Lackluster Marriage. Walt Whitman. That's a good book. Take your time. I'm glad to have it in good hands. Rick. Oh. ba ba bum. I think Mom was getting fresh with Rick. Escape from Ghost Mansion. That just sent chills up my spine for no reason other than I'm in a mansion. Alright, cool. Big empty closet. His and hers bathroom. Very nice. Cinnamon. Ooh. Oh, nice tub. After the honeymoon, rediscovering your spouse personally, spiritually, and sexually. Okay. Someone that was their toilet reading? Ok, 
Okay. So that was the sister's place. I haven't been down this way yet. Oh god. Oh, my heart. That... That scared me. Sam's dark room. Do not enter if red lights are on. Oh, she made a dark room in the attic? That's awesome. Some, some, some sort of art studio. Heavens to Betsy. Oh, there's a tape player right there. Oops. Oops. Heavens to Betsy. Also, was the bookmark guy's name Rich? Can't remember already. Halloween show, The Misfits. Don't forget your costume. Costume? Sometimes you just have to lie to mom and dad. Like when Lonnie asked me to see a band with her and stay over at her friend's place in the city after. That's a lie to mom and dad situation. But it was so worth it. The girls on stage were just so loud and real and awesome. And everybody was moving together like one huge tide of sound. Between two songs, Lonnie leaned over and said, How do you like your first show? I was so happy. I felt tears starting in my eyes, Aww. and then she up and hugged me. I think she could tell. I'll fight you. Oh. Captain Allegra and the first mate. Lonnie, holy crap, I was in the library and I noticed something in the corner. I found a secret passage and it had Oscar's creepy old stuff in it. The closet. Wait, it goes to mom and dad's room? Okay, that did not sound like... Fucking thundering lightning. Sewing room, sitting room, mom and dad's room. So, should I go check out the secret or go to the attic? Secret, okay. I wonder if I can get to it from this side, though. Oh, I can! Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, creepy. Ghost Hunter Sam and Lonnie's Secret House Investigation Log. 
Hidden compartments found three. Library, upstairs hall, foyer. Oh shit. Evidence of supernatural discovered zero. Oh my god. Jesus. Okay. Getting the fuck out of there. Ah. For God so the world. For God so loved the world he gave his only son. Take it back. Take him back with you. Oh, that fucking light bulb thing scared the shit out of me. And now I'm all the way downstairs. Oh, wait, there's secret compartments, right? Mm. Oh, there's one in this hallway. Private do not read. The Green Glacier Part 2. Half of Sam's locker combo. Wait, where was this locker? Was it in the sister's room? Why did I not see it? It was in the sister's room, okay. I know you told me to open it, and I asked you where it was, and you said nothing. You get nothing! At Todd's brother's place after the show, there was only a futon to sleep on, so Lonnie and I shared it. The lights went out. I was turned toward her, my eyes started to adjust, and then I could see she was looking at me, too. In the dark, she smiled. My heart was beating so fast. I rolled over, I felt so, I don't know, nervous? After a minute, she put her arm around me, and was so close, and whispered in my ear, I really like you. I just nodded my head, and I really hope she could tell. I really hope that she meant what I think she did. I felt like a shook up can of soda ever since. I hope we have the chance to talk before I explode. Actually, shook up can of soda is a really good analogy for that feeling. Hello, hello, who are you? Oh shit. Okay, either this is the sister playing a prank on me, or they actually did the Ouija board thing and Oscar's still in this fucking house. Okay, I got the Sam's locker combo. Closing that door so nothing creeps up behind me. Zero fifty one. Okay, this is not how these kind of locks work, but sure. Examine photo. Oh, cute. 